My name is Gouda. I live in an onion pot. Just, just don't ask my calories. Just don't ask my calories. Just don't ask my calories. Hi, welcome to Fine Dining. I'm Puff. And I'm Pastry. Today we're going to try something new and let you know whether the dining is fine or should be left behind. So what's on the menu? So today we have an appetizer from Aldi. We love Aldi! It is appetitos, caramelized onion and gouda mini puff pastries. Those words are all the best. Yeah, it was, it really, it was very enticing. Yes, also we've had other things from Appetito, and mm -hmm. I think we like them. Yeah, yeah. So that's one of their brands. Um, it's like it sounds, it's, just, it's like their appetizer stuff. Latin for appetizer. <laughs> so these are, um, these came with a little partner, which was cranberry feta. Which Tough also pastries, yeah. But we went with this one just because we are big fans of caramelized onion. And Gouda. Onion is wonderful, but then when you caramelize it, it brings it to a whole nother level. Right. We are hoping it does that with this. So, yeah. So, um, these are out for, I think, holiday entertaining. Yes. They come 12 in a box. The perfect party treat. Yeah. So, um, do you think we should dig in? I certainly do. Okay. <laughs> they look toasty. They look toasty. Let's smell them. Mm, they smell kind of baked -y and mm -hmm. they smell really good and they smelled really good cooking. Yes. Mm. Okay. Okay. Tasty. Very. Mm -hmm. Kind of surprising. I thought this was gonna be a little mediocre, but it's Mm -hmm. quite rich. Yes, rich is a great <laughs> word for it. Um, it has, like you can kind of tell that it's all butter pastry. It says that on the box. Oh yeah. It's kind of got, um, yeah, that like rich buttery taste. Rich. It has, um, and the, the Gouda. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> the, the Gouda also adds to the richness. It's creamy. Mm -hmm. And then the caramelized onions add sweetness. Yes. Perfect combination. Yeah. So, and it get, it got like really toasty around the edges, which was kind of nice, kind of like, like a mini, the gourmet of gourmetest mini grilled cheese or something. Yeah. That's my kind of grilled cheese in mm -hmm. baby form. Yeah. So I like them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's another version of a little mini pie kind of thing. Pastries, <laughs> right. pies. Right. Savory, a little mini savory pie. Yeah. It's very good. So it has, um, an also not very complicated. No, it's got like it, it's the three pastry, main things. You yeah. got your Gouda, you got your caramelized onion and man, they're working well together. Yes. Um, and it's like a nice little size. I mean, you could probably get, I don't know if you took big bites, it might be two bites, but I'd oh, yeah. say three bites out of three? it. Don't you think? Well, I don't know. I could down that in one if I want. Well, yeah, you could. But I mean, if you're nibbling at it's a party. It's more of a two bite, I guess. Yes. It's you, a two bite appetizer. You don't want to be a monster at a party <laughs> in <and> one bite. <laughs> <laughs> they are, um, yeah, I, I like that because it's that, um, it does feel special. It does. Mm -hmm. If you're going to some sort of a holiday do, this is kind of a good thing to bring. You're going to be a hero. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It doesn't taste like your normal average. Right. Frozen appetizer. Right. It's a... If you get, I mean, we haven't tried the other ones yet, the cranberry feta ones, but you could do like a combo plate. Oh yeah. Of the two. Cause the cranberry feta ones are shaped the same way with the same, um, structure. Yeah. Holiday party, cranberry, feta. Mm -hmm. Ooh. This would be good. Like among other, like, uh, like this would be, Good with like a charcuterie oh, type, yeah. type setup. It's definitely, it makes sense that it was in the appetitos line because it's an appetizer tasting thing. You wouldn't want that as a meal. That's, you'd have a right. few, but it wouldn't really. 
a couple of bites is enough. Right. <laughs> okay, so let's give it a rating. Let's. I will give it a seven and a half. Seven and a half. Interesting. I'm going to go eight. It is a high quality appetizer. That gouda is really rich and dense and it tastes like something special. It does. If you got that as an appetizer at a fancy restaurant, you'd be happy. And this is a little cheapy Aldi item and it's giving you the same vibe. So. Mm-hmm. I like like I liked the idea of it being a little fancy grilled cheese. Yeah. It is kind of like that. It is. That was very. It has that toasty, that toasty cheese taste. Yeah, they're like, how do we take a grilled cheese and make it even more caloric? So we'll... <laughs> and tastier. And tastier. So. <laughs> I want to. I like the idea of adding, adding caramelized onions to my grilled cheese sandwich. This yes. is something we should do. I think it is. This is actually one of the few items that I don't want to put my onion crunchies on because <laughs> it, it already actually already, is it already covered the onion flavor exactly <laughs> but like i said also sweetness it also added sweetness. adds the sweetness and the sweet and the savory creamy goodness on top of puff pastry what could go wrong exactly yeah we're gonna make a grilled cheese sometime put some caramelized onion on there mm. be good stuff yeah so I think you should pick these up. The They won't be around long. I'm sure they'll go away. It's one of those rotated things. Oh, yeah. So when you see them, get them. Might as well get the cranberry ones, too. Yeah. We'll try to get those. Mix but... and match. See what you like. Yeah. So we will see you next time on Fine Dining. Fine Dining, y'all.